everybody and welcome back to another week of things you might have not known about. And this week we're going to be learning 7 things you might have not known about the Venus flytrap. Venus flytraps are plants that, unlike most plants, don't get their nutrients solely from soil or sun, but mainly insects that cross their path. The Venus flytrap has two leaves that look like a mouth, and little hairs at the end of each of these leaves called cilia, that act like prison bars to trap insects. Inside of each of the leaves are more littler hairs called trigger or sensitive hairs. Whenever something touches these hairs just enough to bend them even a little bit, they snap shut, trapping whatever unsuspecting creature crawled inside. Their leaves can snap shut in less than a second. The trap will not shut all the way at first because small insects may get caught, and they won't provide enough nutrients for the Venus flytrap, so they leave their mouth open just a wee bit so the smaller insects can have a chance to escape. The Venus flytrap closes its leaves and doesn't catch an insect, but maybe a pebble or a small nut for example. The trap will reopen in about 12 hours and kind of spit it back out. Ew. The trap tightly constricts the insect and discharges digestive juices much like the stomach acid in us humans. The fluid dissolves the innards of the insect but not the outside called the exoskeleton because it's hard and tough. After about 5-12 to 12 days the trap reabsorbs the digestive fluid then reopens to start the process over again. The time variance can change depending on how large the insect is because bigger means more time the temperature, the age of the trap, and the number of times it has gone through the process. The Venus flytrap is one of the easiest carnivorous plants to grow. They have minimal requirements such as wet roots, high humidity, full sun, and poor soil. If an insect is too big to fit in the leaves of a Venus flytrap and sticks out, allowing bacteria and molds on the insect to thrive, the trap will turn black, rot, and fall off. If you are interested in the classification of the Venus flytrap, then you'll be pleased to know that's on screen, but I can't read it because it's in Latin. But you'll be pleased to know that there's a span of six orders, nine families, and 595 species. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button down below. If you have any comments for anything you would want me to make a video of, go ahead and put that down in the comments. And if you are new to the channel, go ahead and hit it, that subscribe button. It really helps out the channel a lot. And now you get to watch the praying mantis eat some bugs like a boss. And the real video will be in the description below the full video and it will also be on an annotation on screen. I hope you guys enjoyed the video.